Thanks for joining me guys for another video beer review and it's a bit of a blast from the past job of this one Boddington's Draft Bitter 3.5% ABV um, God, another, you know, I have to go back 15 years since I had this last Don't see it around that often um, Managed to get one can of it as well out of an uh, uh, off licence on my travels um, £1.9 a can 500ml I think, no 440 sorry so let's get out into a glass see what we get I'm not expecting miracles going to be along the same sort of lines as maybe Caffrey's or Worthington Cream Flow Okay, a little bit of a cascade effect to it. No, uh, nothing on you know like the the likes of a, a Guinness or anything like that, and it's levelled off quite quickish. Amber beer, creamy one finger, white head, slow carbonation. God, that's memory lane. Almost like a, a sweet honey sort of smell to it. Maybe a little bit of breadiness. Oh, let's dive in. Cheers. And there's not a lot going on with it. You know that already, though. Malty sweetness to it, breadiness. Of course, easy, easy drinking stuff. And at 3.5, it's beer after beer. You know, you could you could sink bloody 15 pints of this stuff. And that's the purpose of it, I suppose. Um, I know back in my day when it when it first came out, I think it was a bit higher than that. I think it was touching four percent ABV. <clears throat> the pubs that I used to go to that, that used to serve it on draft, um, and yeah, I used to just knock them back and not think about it. And it's got that factor to it. There's not a great deal going on with it. It's not completely void of flavour, but it's um, it's borderline, and you know, sweet multi breadiness really um, it's refreshing but it's not drain poor and if I found myself in a situation where this was the best of the bunch then I'd, I'd drink it and I'd just I'd just switch off um, and just just drink it for the sake of it to be honest with you but it's not disgusting. Just a bit of a plain Jane, I suppose. But it's a review. There we go. Boddington's Draft Bitter. I think AB Yimbev own them now. Yeah, not too sure when they bought them out. I'm guessing it's a few years ago now. There you go. Boddington's Draft. See you on my next one. Cheers.